On today's episode of Exploring Fighters, we head out to sea again on one of the most adventurous missions we have done to date. We head to these abandoned oil rigs. Now there is numerous abandoned oil rigs, abandoned for about 7 or 8 years, but we're focusing on one today. We will go back and do the rest, but one takes about 2 days to completely explore. So we're going to see as much as we can, but I will say this, it ends in tragedy. You already know. We're officially here. Scotland we are. Oh wow. shit. Five hour drive to go. Exactly five hours. Where is it? I do my jet or like that on the bag. Not bad. Right, uh, can I just move this a second or yeah. are you doing something with it? I'll just... It's, no, it's a kid's size, because you know, oh. you're still... So, uh, I'll still float. Well, no, it's only six stone. It's float down totally there. Float, mate, yeah. Huh? It's only, how, what do you weigh? Like 150, 160. Are you worried about this? Oh yeah, so that's like 10 stone, so yeah, he wants to support your weight. He's saying he wants to support my weight. He's saying he wants to support my weight. Won't, yeah, well. Right, that's the there one you go. press that button it stops it and obviously that's the throttle and that's the gear forward and that's the gear back but it will not go into gear until you throttle down okay then the, that will shift into position because if you revved it up and you put it in gear you uh, it's just in case Matt has a heart attack yeah, yeah that's what I'm thinking I'm like what? I was actually worried he was gonna say you can go off on your own <laughs> It's gonna get you, bro. I'll see if I can get you in and I'll walk you out and then I'll start the engine. Don't give him special treatment. Philly's wellies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, we are about to embark on an amazing adventure. Oh, look at this. coming in with me. Oh, damn. I'll probably. I'll... I like a bit of cold feet. You know how it is. I'll come on this side. I'll sit on this side to balance it. Yeah. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah, oh bro, if you can do that, bro, I'll buy you dinner. What? He's gonna fly the drone over us as we're, as we're going on there. Oh, that'll be sweet. All right, this is gonna be a mission. Well, I've seen a fish jump, unless it was Loch Ness Monster. <laughs> we're not in the Loch Ness, though. So. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you, Steve. I'll see you soon. Good bit, bro. Miles ago. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Come on, baby. Kick Come on. In. Oh no. Come on. Oh no. Is this is this it? It's just because uh, yeah. it wants me to take the choke off now. I don't want to end up in Davy Jones's locker. No. No, you'll be alright. I gotta fix this by the time soon. Yeah, it doesn't look healthy 
does it? Because it's running rich. Yeah. Does this for every time you haven't used it for a while, it's always like ah, yeah. For a while. Yeah, I feel like it, this happened to us like classic two stroke. We're gonna explore this oil rig. I've never been on an oil rig. How many people can say they've been on an oil rig? <laughs> uh, not sure how long it's gonna last. Pray for us. It's gonna be epic though. Hold us so we don't get scratched because there's nothing but barnacles on these things and they'll rip the side. So you have to hold us off to hold us, you know, so we don't drift. Yeah. Up. Yeah. Wow, look at the ladder. There's no way I would ever climb that ladder. That one right there, all the way up. No way. The stairs, all the way up. They look like steel. They look actually not that bad. I was expecting a bit worse. Wow. Wow, it's massive when you get close to it. Yeah, really big. It's like a, oh, you mean, it's like a dock right here. They have barnacle over it, bro. Yep. Barnacles. Barnacle head. <laughs> All right. We're docking. This is scary. Wow. It's massive. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. We're coming up. It's actually pretty leveled up to the same. Tide's pretty good on us. Our favor, not that windy. We're doing pretty good right now. Okay. It's all right. Should I keep the life jacket on now? You're good with it? Yeah, you can keep that. All right. I just, just put it somewhere and grab it later on. I got you. Okay, so we've got on the oil rig. I'm going to talk to you when we get up there, but this is a lot bigger than I expected. From out there, sure, it just doesn't look too big, but when you're here, I mean, look at the size. <laughs> and yeah, we got a long ass. <laughs> oh, I did not actually look up at it properly before. Holy shit. I know. Bro. I know. That's going to be horrible. It's going to sway, you know, as well. I'm a bit nervous. I'm just going to go up and not look back. Right down. Come on, bro. Let's just go. <laughs> go. I don't want to think too much about it or I won't do it. Right, hang on. i got to get mine now. <laughs> yeah, it's a scaffold. It's a freaking scaffold stairs. I mean, it's, it seems stable, but when you get further up the top, it's gonna, it is going to wobble a bit. So let's just... Uh, take our time. I was going to say go as fast as you can, but yeah, take your time. It's because of stuff like this, it's like the hooks, look at them, they're rusty. I know. The rusty hooks. Oh. Dude, I'm actually kind of worried now already. I'm already kind of nervous. I'm not even kidding. I mean, it should fall. It should. Bro, I don't know if I could do this. <laughs> I don't know if I could do this. Oh my god. Even, we're the second level. Oh my god. Bro, I really don't know if I can go up. There's another like 30 levels to go. Alright, I'm just I'm just gonna film and just keep my camera down, I'm not gonna look. I'm just gonna not be attention. Okay. Not what I had in mind. A mass. I'm, I'm watching Matt, I think he's brought down. Okay. Oh man. Bro. Bro. Holy hell. I held my breath for the whole thing. I was Ooh. shaking hard, bro. Right. You can hear the, the rumbling. Where's the bar? <laughs> I don't even know what to hold it for. You think they have bars and you think people sleep here? I don't know. They must stay in the oil rig for like months, right? Bro, yeah. People live on here. Wow. We're gonna go explore. This is, I don't This is crazy. Bro, look how, look how high it is. Oh my God. Oh. That's horrible, look man. That you, though. That's horrible. That's what's happening! I'm gonna go this way and see where I am. That's in a bit, Josh. Oh, wow. 
Haus nachfahren. Oh, well, this is a uh, control room. I'm gonna get my breath, I'm gonna chill out and get my breath, but wow, oh, control room. Pretty damn cool. We'll take a look soon. Okay, so this is the layout of um, of the oil rig, but it is in English. Yeah, um, I did see something a bit weird. I'll show you in a minute. Walkie talkie. Still has power. Turn that off. Um, yeah, so these, look at these. Little Russian or something. Mints, maybe? Vegan edition. Okay. Torches. That work. Okay, this will work. Oh, this is. Just like a little maintenance bag. More lights and a walkie talkie. Hold on. Um, this could be a problem. Bananas that are still kind of fresh. Okay, let me get Josh. This could be a slight problem. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Fresh tomatoes. Fresh bananas. Fresh ham. Looks like a day too old. Okay. Let's find Josh. Josh, Yo. come to the pilot yes. house. Where's that? That main cabin that the captain is. Why? You need to come here quick. Okay, I'm coming. Right. All right, Josh is on his way. Um, he was on his phone, so he must have found something strange or from, I don't know, I don't, I don't say. Not right now, I'm kind of uh, dazed, I don't know what to think. Someone's here. This has not been used in years and years and years. But someone is definitely on board with us. Unless they could be living here for all we know. Could live here. I don't think we're alone. Laven? I don't think we're alone. No? No. What do you mean? The pilot house. I think we're on board with someone. Fresh food. That ham has not been open for less than a day. Cheese, tomatoes, in date. I think I don't think we're alone. Come here, look. Walkie talkies. Still have power. We're not alone. I think someone's here with us. I don't know. And whoever it is, I think they might be Russian or something, because I think that's like Russian language. Wow, yeah. You know what it is? It could be other explorers though. Because there's graffiti all over spray painted with I, I know, pieces. but I don't why would why would other explorers have this kind of equipment? Yeah, true. I don't know. Wow. But look at all this stuff. What's with the radiation tape? Radioactive. Well, nothing can't be radioactive here. Just don't go too crazy then, huh? Yeah, we need to, what? Yeah, we could be a long way. Serial killer for all we know. Could be a serial killer up here. Well, there's an axe right here in front of the door. Oh, brilliant. Just saying. Great. That's not good. <laughs> ah, that's perfect. Uh, I've not checked wow. in there yet. What is all this? Oh, this is the, the area that's radioactive. It's showing you where it is because it's, it's, it's painted. It must be like... I don't know. I'm assuming this is the area for it. But then again, it's over the whole thing. Can't be. I think whoever's staying here is maintenance because look at all the cans of WD-40, which is a lubricant. Well, yeah, remember, they, they think that in like 10 years or 20 years, these are going to be working, so they're maybe yeah. they're trying to kind of maintain them enough. Someone is, someone could be. 
Yeah. It, uh, I've not checked in there. Could be someone sleeping in there. I mean, dude, all this is destroyed, man. All this is all messy. Hang on, I'm gonna get my light. Right, well, we're gonna go and explore this place. If we bump into someone, then so be it. Here's the sandwich. I got my light on, bro. I don't see anyone here, but see how destroyed everything is? I feel like other explorers were just here, bro. They were just like making sandwiches and relaxing how we're doing it. Because all this is shattered. Moved over. Nothing's working. The power's off. You know what I mean? If anything, I don't know. What is this? Oh, for oh, for like welding. These are really cool. Look at these heli deck crew. I like them. Helicopter pad. So that's my Lord of Worlds. Don't, don't go in the mud lab. I don't know what's in it. Go in the mud lab. Well, it was a real lab though, bro. <gasps> Must be all like... That's cool. I didn't realize yeah. they had laboratories on here. Me either. It's a small one though. I'm sure. Try to keep this place just as it was when we left. So I think this what, what this is, um, there's like sedimentary stuff that runs through here and it's like a um, gold pan, you know, where they shake it oh, and right. sift it out. Right. That's what this is. You're smart boy. I think if you're not right, no, you could try. <laughs> yeah, good try. I'll see this is down below. Like to the water. I want to go up there and see that. Yeah, this is like a conveyor belt in there.
dimensions. I've got uh, holes in my shoes and now the leaking and squeaking water. Wow, look at that one up there. That's cool. Definitely not every day you're exploring an oil rig. I had no idea they were like this. So these like, I'm pretty sure these are clamps, the actual drill themselves. The drill will go through there and it would hold the drill in place. A lot of cool equipment in here. A lot of flanges and stuff. Listen to them shoes. Oh, I've got to come back and look at this. That is amazing. I'll go and take a look at that in a second. What's that beeping? It's been beeping. Is it? Oh my god, there's a... I don't like the smell here. I like it. You think it's okay? It smells like oil, yeah. Oh, that's oh, oil smell? Yeah. I was like freaking out thinking it's like gas or something. Okay, so March 2014 is a interesting yeah, looking. That was when it was last used, bro. Interesting looking calendar. Whoa. This is all radioactive here. All of it. And it's all covered in tape. I'm just going to leave because I don't... <laughs> I'm out of here. Wait, yeah, that smell is radioactive. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> My ass. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> Get out of here. It's only radioactive. That's my export level, bro. <laughs> I'm fucking scared. Really? It's just too creepy. It's too crazy here. <laughs> I wonder what L LSA means. What means radioactive LSA. So should we open these? Yeah. All right. Don't. <laughs> <touch that. laughs> The only thing that ever scares Josh is radiation. Ra ra uh, it, radiation. I wonder what the, uh, they don't have nuclear energy on on oil rigs, do they? Uh, no, but 
They said they're making those next or something. That's what uh, Matthew Williams said. That's like the next thing. God, I actually really like the calendars. Yeah, me too. Um, Mum, for Christmas, could I get one of these calendars, please? Thank you. Where is that beat? Where is it coming from? Don't know. A lot of this joint. Oh, I wonder what these are. Don't know. Not these. Lockbox, lock out for safety. Alright bro, good luck. 24 hours in the radia radiation vault. Yeah, This is cool. I would love something like this. Look at this. Saws, presses, vice grips, axle stands. Oh, a lot of fun stuff in here. Welders. There's a lot of welders here. So much equipment just left. Oh, I'm... Here we go, it's a walking toolbox. Oh. Not very well stocked though. Look at this. We were here in 2017. Definitely other explorers wrote that. <laughs> oh, look at the size of some of these. Well. I know, I know a lad. I know, I know Bucky and Wheatman would be uh, pretty satisfied looking at this. Bucky, oh, look at the size! Oh, yes, huge, bro. <laughs> I know Bucky and Wheatman do love a, a huge one. A spanner, that is. <laughs> Even the sockets are massive. Size of some of these sockets. You can tell when, when a, a petrol head walks into somewhere like this, and I mean, you don't even see these kind of stuff. Maybe if you're working on lorries and whatnot. Look at that! Look at them! Hey Josh, good luck. Leaving you with the drone. See you, bro. Uh, catch you in a bit. Be safe. Hey, if you if you if you encounter anyone, do the secret call. <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> This place so far is unbelievable. Oh, I haven't even told you yet. Interesting development, scary development, bad development. Matthew Williams called. He's on the on the on the rig right now. 
but his engine seized on the boat, completely knackered. So it was overheating when we when we saw it steaming. It was overheating. Uh, the impeller is not working, which is not cooling down the engine, so it's fully seized. We have to roll back um, against the current. It's going to be difficult, and that means Steve and Dave can't get on on board, which is uh, a shame for them. But yeah, unfortunately, they won't get on. Okay, washroom. Laundry. Oh, locker room, it stinks. Yo! Oh, I thought it was a theatre then. Oh, look at this, it looks like they're in a movie. A, a, a movie theatre. A cinema. Sorry, I'm spending too much time with Josh. Yeah, we need old. Well, there was a TV here. Maybe it was a theatre. Oh shit, that's cool. Okay, I could live here. <laughs> I could legit live here. Yeah, yeah. Bro, have you seen this? Oh, is this your home cinema? Right, yeah. Daddy, yeah. You, you, you step it up every time I see you. When I you put know. The clouds on the ceiling. Well, man. that's next week. It's yeah. a sticky. It's a sticky and fluffy job. But look, we, we made a start. Wow. Yeah. You like it? Home theatre, except I can't see the screen. Yeah, the... Yeah, they've nicked the screen. Vandal's nicked it. And they probably nicked the video projector. Oh, that's pretty damn cool in here. Right, what else we got? Oh, this is more what I want to see, so it's like high quality. Oh, okay, this is the VIP lounge. Oh, yeah. Oh, we've got TV at VIP lounge, look at them. Sadly, Chilling out. a plasma. Yeah, it's they're old allowed school. to have matches, like on, a, on an oil rig. They're allowed to smoke. Yeah. Got matches. Look at all the uh, ashtrays. And yet, on land, probably not allowed to smoke. But, I know, wonder if it comes under different laws. Yeah, maritime laws. Yeah, oh, yeah. So okay. in international waters, you can do what you like. <laughs> okay. Ooh. What is, oh, what is that? What the hell is this? It's a gaze room there. No way. Gaze. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. Wait! An internet, so he can spy on you and you send your emails. Huh. Make sure you're not sending any um, sensitive secrets. Stuff. It's got the passwords on internet. It's PrinCrew1, password January 10. There you go. This is, a, this is amazing. But we could we could live like kings here. We could bowl every night. <laughs> could stay playing poker. Huh. Oh, this is cool. I like this. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Right, we're leaving this section. Oh, cafeteria. Okay. Man, this is pretty damn good. Oh, and look. Look out the window at the oil rigs. Sometimes when you're walking around you forget where you are. There's a big kitchen. Big kitchen. Still smell smells like curry. Walking fridge and cutlery bits, utensils. Washroom, pot wash, mixer. Fridges and all. Oh, that's that. I know that leads. That leads out to where the deck house is. Uh, changing rooms, a naffy room, of some sort. Just offices.
Okay. Bedrooms. Interesting. That's quite a lot of them. You could legit stay here. Medical bay. This is the medical bay. Wow, <laughs> it's like a mini hospital. Cardiac, vitamin K's, miscellaneous antibiotics, allergy. Okay. Respiratory. Cool stuff in there. Mrs. Brown boys. Okay. cleared all all of this out. No toilet. Now this still looks pretty well set up. Mouthwash there. This is all nice and neat. Hmm. So it keeps going, going. <laughs> Nintendo Wii. This has been ransacked in her office. More bedrooms. Oh, back to where we started. Alright, Ocean Princess. Okay, 2014. Last time. Look at the live vessels here. Might ju not just be live vessels, they might be. They might bring. I don't know, they might bring them up. No, they definitely are live vessels. I was going to say they might just bring them over. Um, staff and crew members over. Oh, this is cool. This is a cool shot. Yes, I'm gonna get a nice photo here. Definitely check out my Instagram, Exploring with Fighters. I run competitions, I do all kinds of stuff. You can chat to me on there in the comments. Um, I try and do as much as I can on there, but yeah, go and follow me. Now, I did think about going over there and opening up and having a look inside, but I am not. Um, they are suspended by winches. And knowing my look, I'm gonna step foot on it, get inside, and it's gonna drop. And I'm not having it. <laughs> so I'm not even going to bother going anywhere near that because it will be my look. I can assure you this. And we'll ask Matthew Williams, see what his opinion on that matter is. Mr. Williams, 
What is your opinion on stepping foot on the life vessels? Uh, <laughs> they're hanging there, man. <laughs> yeah. They're just hanging in the air. Okay, edge. yeah, exactly what oh. I just said. Oh. I just wanted to ask your opinion to make sure I'm not being a pussy. B-Face would do it, so you'll have to well, do it to show him up now. Yeah, well, that's him, you know. Yeah. I'm, I'm probably going to live longer than that guy for that reason, okay? Yeah. I mean, look at the drop. <laughs> yeah, if that drops, that's going to be painful. Yeah, if you just went straight down, if that just... Like that, you know, you wouldn't probably survive inside there. No, probably not. G-forces would kill you. Yeah. So, yeah, actually, um, I didn't realise this, but oil rigs are self-propelled, but they only do about one mile an hour. Yeah. They, I, they I don't know how fast they go, but I, I would reckon it's going to be pretty slow. Oh, sorry. But this is the nerve centre, you know. If this would have been a compass, but they've taken the compass out. Wow. Oh, because Computers, like the speed controls, rudder, rudder, automatic rudder controls. So it will steer the rudder for you automatically. So you've got, you've got a front left thruster and a front right thruster. So obviously if you have more than one, it's going to it's going to steer and you've got rudder controls as well. Okay, so, very uh, cool. Look, you've got foam, pick it up, dial. So if, it, if everything dies, I can hear it's making a noise in my ear. It's making a noise. It's like going, woo, 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 woo. <laughs> so it works. <laughs> Radar. Right, well, I don't know whose all this food is. Radar. Matt, I don't know whose it all is, right? Yeah. Whether it's someone who looks after the boat, or engineers, or if it's been one of our explorers. But I'll tell you what I am going to do. I'm going to make Dave. them, a, I'm going to make them, a, no, I'm going to make them a sandwich and leave it here. Oh, so when they finally get back on the boat, I'm like, what the hell? 13th of October. Yeah, well, that, yeah, that one's 12th of October. On so I'm, I'm going to make them a sandwich. I'm going to make a sandwich. Are you ready? Okay then, what do we have here? Right, we've got a slice of bologna, we've got a slice of hot, uh, cheese, we've got some tomatoes. Um, a, little, a little bit not very ripe now. And we've got one slice of bread, so we're going to try and make them something decent, okay, when they get back. You ready? Here we go. It's starting to get dark, man. Right, stick that back in there. No, don't yeah. waste. <laughs> it starts to get dark. Yeah, just yeah. make them a quick sandwich when they get back on board. Got a slice of cheese here. It's right. cheap. Okay, the cheese is getting a little bit hard, so I'm not going to go from the end where it's starting to dry, but I'm going to go from this bit here. All uh, right, so there we go. Pieces. One thing I've noticed, they've no, they've no uh, butter, but I'll tell you what they have been doing. They've been using mayonnaise as lubricants, so why should they be way too dry? So, a bit, of, a bit of that mayo on there, they're running low though, I might have to put a note on the fridge, let them know they need to stock up on mayonnaise. A slice of ham, and to top it off, we've got a few tomatoes. Now the bread isn't bad, I mean it's a little bit brittle, you can see it's breaking apart there, but that's not a bad, I mean, I'd even eat that myself, but we're going to leave it there. Um, I'm going to leave it there for them. And I'm going to leave a note as well. I'm going to write a little note just saying, uh, made you a sandwich, for you might be hungry, enjoy. Um, okay, no, no piece of paper, but what makes it even better then is the mystery. They're going to get on this boat, whoever, if there's welders uh, maintaining it or whatever, they're going to get on the boat and they'll be like, John, did you make a sandwich? And he'll be like, Nah, I can't even remember. Did you make a sandwich, Bill? He's like, nah, not me. They're like, they'll be sat around baffled. They'll be in here talking about it for hours. Who made the, uh, the ham and cheese and tomato sandwich? Well, the sun is starting to set. Um, we do have a row against the tide with the tide coming in and um, some swells. So, yeah, we're going to enjoy that. It's going to be pretty damn fun. I think it's down to bounce now. Yeah, no, I was just saying that. I was looking for like I'm good. Yeah, it's getting dark. We're going to be fighting against the uh, tide in the dark. It's going to be know, dangerous. I told everyone that we're paddling back too. <laughs> You're paddling back. Literally paddle back. How do we get out of here? Dude, you see anything that I didn't? What, what have you seen? What's cool? Have you been in here? Uh, the rooms. That's the, yeah. Yeah. Rooms. Um, did, seen, you know, did you see the game room? Where the TV lounges and it shows the gambling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 
Okay, yeah. So are we seen it all then? Okay, yeah, I think we've seen all the best bits. Yeah. Alright, how do we get out of here? This way? Right, yeah, this way. Matthew's already gone down, so he's waiting for us. I don't know what they're doing over there. It's an announcement from another oil rig. That's a fuck. Yeah. <laughs> That's a working oil rig. I mean, we're in an abandoned one, though. Matthew Williams looks like an ant from up here. Is he? Yeah. You can see him. It looks like a toy boat, bro. Where? Down there. Oh, my God. And this is shaking. Yeah, there's the boat right there. You can barely see the yellow one. Good luck, dude. It's not something I enjoy doing, but no. it's got to be done. You already know if you want to see the best, you've got to be the best. Yes. Well done. That is pretty high up there. That's higher <laughs> just, than just any a bit. Up, to be honest. Just a bit. Yeah. Come on, Josh, what are you doing? Just focus, can't hear you. He's, he's a pro. I've seen that him and that Ronin going up. Um, that Ronin? That Ronin guy. That Ronin kid? Yeah. Yeah, look at the rope ladder on there. My, my thing's going again. Your, your ass calling my people phone again, is Matthew. Again. My phone is like opened up and it's going to. Like, do, you not, do, you, do you not have a, a thingy? Do you not have a lock for it? I don't know. I don't know. It's meant to turn the screen off. But. So, yeah. Um, yeah, Josh. It's a good thing we didn't take something like this. This metal rope ladder. Who did that? Well, it snapped. I don't know. But I bet you it's heavy. So it'll be aluminium, won't it? Yeah. Imagine that. And it snaps. Yeah, we are leaving. Uh, one thing I do want to say before we get on the boat is I get asked a lot of times, Dan, are you afraid of dying? You know, because you do some crazy stuff. And the honest answer these days is no. I'm not afraid of dying. My fear of death was always uh, the fear of being forgotten and I don't believe I'm going to be forgotten now if I do die so yeah <laughs> I'm not afraid of death if my time comes it ca my time comes at least I've lived it to the fullest and done stuff that is out of my comfort zone almost all day every day you already know Josh dude even if we die, which explorers never die, again, like all our stuff's online forever. So that's what I mean. Is right? is it's, 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 we're leaving behind a legacy. Yep. Um, future explorers will be able to look back at what we did and appreciate it because maybe they have technology in the future where they don't have to do half the hard you work we just do. Teleport exactly. Yeah. Instant translocation. <laughs> yo, yo. Oh, okay. So that's what it's going to be like in the future, is it? It's all about just, Dragon Ball Z. All ah, right. Okay. If you know, you know. Okay, yeah, yeah. If you know, you already know. Right, time to get on the boat. Right, okay. Um, where am I going to sit for rowing? You think you could get here? I can't. Is you there boys are going to have to sit right at the back. Yeah. In between you, the engine. You the other side of this. Um, yeah, you've got to move back, Josh. Right now? Yeah, you've got to move right back. Yeah. So, so how are you getting in? I've got this. It's alright. You can pull it. So if you get back here, I'll move this back. I'll sit on the fuel tank and row, 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 row your boats. Do you know that song, Josh? Row, 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 row your boat. <laughs> right, I want, I want nothing but pirate tunes the whole way back. Okay. I think we could get some. Yeah. Oh, I've got, I've got pirate metal on my phone, but I'm, I'm thinking like we can go for some old school yeah, kind of stuff. I've old got, school pirate yeah, music. I've got Spotify. What was we're that? Leaving. We're leaving anyway. They test, test there a lot. Yeah, I'm sorry. Have you grab that? Still have. <laughs> gotcha. Right. All you have to do is undo that little, little one that's there. Okay. And it just reel through then. All right. One second. You right there? Yeah. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, we're doing it. No, it's not. What's well, you not? just... 
<laughs> we, we kind of had it the right way. No. <laughs> got three guys in a boat. <laughs> what the boat they're doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. No, Matt's a, gr- a brilliant, um, you know, I did have it the right captain. way, then. No, but, you did? But, I did have it the right way. But with a motor, maybe not some... With a motor, yeah, but... Matt, I don't think you're a, you're an oarsman. Well, I got over here okay. They were the you did row here. 40 minutes to get from... Yeah, the but, but look look how fast we're travelling here, and I had to go against the uh, the tide. <laughs> yeah, we're just, we're just going out with the, with the sea. We are here. going out at sea. <laughs> we're going out at sea, boys! We are really going out at sea, guys. This ain't good, man. All right, now this is the professional Olympic swarm with fighters. We're just gonna. Well. Yeah. It's not turning. Wrong one. Yeah. <laughs> Wrong one, That's boys. One. Oh, oh man. Very, very, uh, we'll figure it out eventually. Oh man. <laughs> oh, Let's just hope we don't get hit by a boat on the ship uh, plane. Oh. <laughs> Alright, we'll, we'll report back when we're on shore, guys. If something happens, we'll keep recording. Grace. Well, we, t- we did it. So, one thing I want to announce on here, you know, this is like behind the scenes stuff now, is Matthew Williams has the keys, and Dan has the keys to the car, and Steve and Dave is at the car, but because the drift is taking us so far out, we can't actually get back there. So we're just gonna pedal straight, and it's gonna drift us off some way down there, and we're gonna have to walk all the way back. It's the only way. It's kind of dangerous out here, I think, but we're doing okay. Yeah, I mean, we'll probably get back just as it's getting dark, but yeah. yeah. It is what it is. What a day. It's straight. Otherwise, you're fighting the tide. Yeah. But if you go straight, you'll just drift with it. Yeah. But if, you, if you're that way, you're gonna go very fast with the tide. Yeah. So it doesn't matter, but. <laughs> what is up everyone? Welcome to the sea. <laughs> Three. <laughs> Welcome to, <laughs> soon to be Davy Jones' locker. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you've just read by the title, um, we have been doing some sea activities today and uh, the boat engine is completely broke. Um, I took a turn rowing for a while and now Matthew Williams has taken over and uh, yeah, we've got quite a way to go. Yeah. So why not have a chat with you guys? Yeah, they know it's us now. <laughs> oh, it's just white or red. Looks like we're on the yeah. boat of doom. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> we are on the boat of fucking doom, <laughs> man. A boat of doom, doom, doom. <laughs> just looking at, <laughs> just looking at Matthew rowing like this is terrifying. Hold on, there we go. It looks like one of those um, horror movies almost. It's starting to rain. Oh it's come it. on. Yeah, it's starting to rain. No way. Yeah. Can you hold that for us a sec? Yeah, yeah I'll hold it's it. It's doing one knot, but it's doing it in that direction. Oh, we're going out to sea again. No, hang on. Let me see which way the drift is going. Oh, it's drift. Do you know why? Look why? Where the drift's going. And I was going like, like that, and I'm just fighting the drift, so we're not going anywhere. Oh. I'm, do- I'm doing two knots this way. It's doing two knots against me. We're not going anywhere. We need to drift up to the shore, man. We need to, we need to go the way the drift is going and, and get to the shore that way. Right, okay. What, five hours to get back to shore? this point i don't know bro minus 0.16 knots minus yeah we're going the other way what if we ju- i have an idea what if we just we don't need to call the coast guard we we're not in danger them. we're not in danger i don't get why it's a minus but what if we just call and say we we're just taking photos honestly oh yeah steve said it's starting to rain yeah, yeah. And I'd rather just say we just call him and say, screw it. Hey, can we get a lift? Our engine died. That's <laughs> hey, it. can we get a no, lift? No, no, like dead ass. We were just ro- we were zoning around. Hey, can you can, can you just get us? Our, our, our motor died. Actually, it is a legitimate reason. Yeah, the motor, the motor yeah. seized. Yeah, it's, we, it's, it's no one's fault. what we're doing. We, yes. we could have been out just taking photos. It's no one's fault. The motor seized. I'd rather just do that on God. <sighs> Start bailing, boys. <laughs> well, is the water. There is water. Yeah, yeah, yeah there's water in here. Right, but no. Oh, do you want to get? Yeah, the, there's quite um, a bit of water in the boat. Get we the, are uh, sinking. The We're not sinking. Get, get, the, the get the bucket. I got it. I got it. <laughs> get the bucket. <laughs> get the bucket, Josh. We're sinking. Fuck, man. <laughs> so much water in the boat. There's not. There's <laughs> not. <laughs> Bro, it's look. It's, it's splashing around my feet. Yeah, I mean, my feet are literally submerged in it. 
<laughs> Where's the bucket, John? I ain't seen no... I don't see no bucket. The pail. Is the it not pail? Oh, look, it's there how much water are you pulling out? Hang on. And you're saying... And you're saying we're not sinking? We're not sinking. We're not sinking yet, boys. <laughs> Explorers <laughs> never give up. Explorers never give up. Help! Help! Oh, you, know well. what, you, know, you know what half that is, what? don't you? What? Fuel. It's petrol. You've, it's coming out of the tongue. Right, that should not be on the floor. Okay. Right, there's no way that should be on the floor. Right. Mm -hmm. um, has anybody stepped on the um, the bulb and pulled the bulb off? What's that? Uh, hang on, hang on. That's yeah. my fault. Right. right, no one light a match. Right, get your feet up. Sorry. Yeah, look, look, look. Right, it's all fuel. Oh, but, yeah. oh shit. Yeah, it's yeah. fuel. Yeah, we're right. right. um, Yeah, it's bad, bro. Yeah, we're still in fuel. You, well, yeah. Can you, um, that's what we're, that, it's not, it's not seawater, it's fuel. Right, um, at the back of the boat, there was a thing. Uh, it was, it was a small, Pipe that went on the end of this and it's been yanked off, so there's no okay. pissing fuel in yet. Okay, that's it. Right, that won't do it now. Right, we'll put it, it's all fuel. Well, you want to wipe it on my new hoodie? <laughs> Halloween merch, bro. Come on. <laughs> right, okay, so yeah, it was fuel, it wasn't seawater. Um, the good thing is, I don't you know where to put that down. It's all right, it's all right. Uh, right. Fuck it there. <laughs> Actually, no, let's use it. Let's see if we can see dry land. Dude, we're just bathing in fuel. Yeah, oh, so that's my light in the fuel. Oh, sh get it out quick. Before it sets off fire. Fucking hell. <laughs> mm. Electronics in fuel, not good. What about our fuel? We're doing 0. 0.73 oh. knots now. Yeah, I should drop in the fuel back some. What if we just call our homies? <laughs> <laughs> We're doing 0. 0.73 knots nicely, yeah. but if we try to go sideways, <laughs> we, we just end up doing diagonal. Oh, the far away then. See. I don't know. I feel like we just call the, the people, bro. Like, I really don't care anymore. It's just getting too much, and it's gonna rain. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. Oh, Nothing a bolt. No, I don't. Aww. Yeah, put your foot in more if you want. Alright. Alright, you ready? Yep. Gonna hold that for him. Right, steer more that way. That's it, that's Sorry. it. You got it. Straight now. Yeah. Right, so keep them in my line of sight then. We're definitely moving. That, that, that's going whoosh back yeah, there. Yeah, we're moving alright. We are moving, boy. Wow, guys. Yes, mate. Yeah, we're getting a... We, it just went doosh. It fucking turned. Whoops. Bye bye. Well, it's still about patience, though. It won't work. Just about breathing and just going slow. Go yourself. Yeah. Come on, I'll let you talk to people. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Right, guys, we're going to cancel our stream. We need to focus. Um, thank you so much, everyone who's donated, everyone who's joined. Mom and Dad will be live at half past eight. Find out updates from them, uh, and I'll see you soon.